You've already been told about strangers dressing up in uniforms, but there are other traps you need to know about. Hi, I lost my little dog. Can you help me find him? If you ever see this man, don't get lost in his eyes, because it's a common trap. Just run! Hi, I'm just playing with my daughter's video games. The battery seems to be dead. Have some in my car. Why don't you come over and help me put them in? Why don't I? Seriously, fellas, would you resist someone who looked like that? Not open the door. I'm not getting the door. Pizza delivery. Oh, okay, well, if you're the pizza guy. Mm. Mm. Got this off some creepy dude at the door. Favorite delivery on pizza? Tastes a little fun. Would you tell anybody about our little secret? I'll kill your dog. Seriously, calm down. You just told me you had a crush on Stacy. I promise I won't tell anyone. Why are we even friends anyways? And I don't have a dog. I lost my little dog. I'll kill your dog. It doesn't get more profound than that, bro. Hey, what's up, O2L? It's Connor. Hey, guys, what's up? It's Ricky on O2L. Hey, guys, what's up? It's Sam. What's up, O2L? Stacy's here. Hello, O2L. It is Trevor. Hey, guys, what's up? It's Ken. I'm been Elijah. You've been awesome. What's up, Elijah here at Just Be Creative. Thank you for joining me on this week of the O2L Reviews. This week on O2L is Strangers Week, and apparently we learned nothing from elementary school. Jack shows up in three and possibly four videos this week, and Wishbone wasn't in a single one. Next thing you know, Jack's probably gonna move in with them. This week we've got Connor kicking us off with a vlog from the homestead about his stranger experiences. And then we've got Mr. Ricky taking selfies with strangers in public, some of which were less than enthused. Hey man, get off my face, man. And then we've got Sam doing a short film about horror. And then we've got JC getting banned from a store for vlogging in it with the people. And then of course we've got Mr. Trevor going out in public claiming he sees celebrities. And then of course we've got Mr. Kean going out and making awkward silences with the people. Well, well, well. Well, well. Well, well, well. What's that, Sassy? You need to speak more clearly. Mr. Francis shares with us some very humorous stranger experiences. One of which was this one. Sitting on the flight next to a couple strangers, I had to fart really badly. And it wasn't one of those experiences where I thought it was going to be silent, but it was loud. It was just, I farted, no one heard it, but they kind of smelt it. And the guy next to me yells, oh, what the f*** is that smell? <laughs> well, doesn't that just stink? I'm being serious, that probably really smelled bad. Ricky encounters a lot of resistance from people who he's trying to get selfish with. Then he encounters some very unusual people. Dill on. Dylan. Dylan. Dylan for dollars. Dylan. And I. You two. You two probably <laughs> are mahoos. <laughs> I would have been afraid that chick was about to come and bite my ankles. I would have been like, no, no. Get back, you sea witch. I've really only met one person to compete with the awkwardness of that person. You and I were in a closet. We couldn't see each other, right? <laughs> couldn't yeah, see each other. Yeah, I understand. Okay, so <laughs> everything we see. I live in a very strange town. But then they met a celebrity! Dude. Okay, my sons are Zach and Cody, oh, Dylan and Cole Sprouse, so with the sweet life. Wait, what? Yes, yeah, those are my boys. You're kidding. Wait, I'm literally <laughs> myself. What did you just do, Jack? That is just nasty, bro. Clean yourself up. Sam made a short film. And you know what that means. Actually, you don't. But you will now. Move in with you! I'm gonna make some popcorn. Hi guys, so this is Jake and this is Joe. And um, Hi. this week... <laughs> what was that about? Uh, that's what I do to my friends before I go to bed. Hey! <laughs> Jake? All this left is a bloody Jake. Oh. He doesn't notice the cameraman behind that thingy. Some stranger is knocking on the doorbell, and er, knocking. The stranger is ringing the doorbell. We're just gonna go to bed. We're gonna forget about it, alright? Is that what you do when you're scared? Yeah, friend. Let me carry you outside into the darkness. 
Paparazzi! Hell! Not bad. I'd say it's about up there with uh, the directing of M. Night Shyamalan. Alright, so I mean, how many clowns out of five would you give this video? Out of film? I'm gonna give you three clowns. Three clowns out of five because it was great. Where it could have. You could have done something really nice with it. So now I want you guys to leave me a comment down below if you think that we should make our own horror film kind of similar to Sam. Let us know. Okay, now I'm gonna get back into the room and finish my review. <laughs> JC's video went over very well. There must be something about his personality that people just really love. Except for the staff. They did not seem to take any jokes. So when she's leading JC away, you can tell she just is not having any of it. She looks like she's planning something the whole time she's walking. Oh yeah, I just got to stare at this price gun the whole time I'm walking. <laughs> However, when she allowed me back into the supply closet area, that's the point when I would have just been like, Run! Last one out gets caught! Then they were kicked out of the store. JC comes back to the apartment. Hey guys, JC here. I officially cannot buy Crest anymore because I've been, well, banned from Ralph's. Trevor had a great idea doing this in public because you're much less likely to get yelled at when you're just taking pictures of people in public. Plus, he looks so super innocent. How could you possibly get upset with a kid who looks like this who wants you to have a picture with him? Keegan's video is hilarious. He totally suits the part for what he is doing. He looks totally cool when he's doing it. He's just so chill. He's just... And that's probably the reason that this is my favorite video out of the week. Just because it was so... It was so him. And this guy is probably my favorite. And that's all there is to talk about. Thank you guys so much for watching. I really loved this week's set of videos. Ow. I bit my tongue. If you liked it and you agree with me, please give the video a big thumbs up. Also, leave me some comments about what I should do. Should I do what Sam did and make a little horror film? Or should I go into public and do some kind of thing with strangers? We report, you decide. Love you guys. I will see you all next week. Same time, same day. Also, feel free to check out uh, last week's review as well as my last two videos. One is a rant about the English language and how we pronounce things and the other are my confessions from last week. So I will see you guys next week, same time, same day. Go, go, go. Hua! Domo arigato gozaimashi. Unless she was a male maxer. Maxer. Unless she was a male max. Unless of course she was a male max. Oh, good lord. Unless of course she was a male max. <laughs> okay, what the heck? I lost my little dog. I'll kill your dog. It doesn't get more profound than that, bro.